Hi peeps, I'm up in Cairns in far north Queensland and this is my three minute guide. No time to be relaxing on a park bench enjoying the view, so let's get to it. Make sure you see the GBR, that's Great Barrier Reef for any Luddites out there. There's over 2,300 kilometres of reef, so it's actually quite hard to miss. It's so ginormous it's visible from space, but it's way cheaper to see it from Cairns. Unless you happen to be Elon Musk, in which case you may want to see it from space. Lucky bugger. Once you've dried yourself off from the reef, enjoy the drive along the Captain Cook Highway and visit Mossman Gorge in the Daintree Rainforest, the oldest rainforest in the world at over 135 million years old. That's the Jurassic period to you and me. If you're lucky, you could even see a Jeff Goldblum. But even if you don't, you'll really enjoy the sights on offer. It's just you and nature at its finest, and probably a few grumpy kids being dragged around by their parents. All this swimming and walking is going to make you hungry. Replenish your energy levels at Hello Harry the Burger Joint. If you're lucky, Harry himself might even cook up your burger. Although no one seems to know who Harry is. If you're still hungry after your burger, check out the Grand Hotel with its carved crocodile bar and even better, $10 steaks. If you're super hungry, they do a two kilo parma or rump steak too. If you're looking for cocktails, you could do a lot worse than head to Miss Chief Bar and Eatery. For example, you could head to McDonald's, in which case you'd be really disappointed with the lack of cocktail options. But at Miss Chief, you can get $12 cocktails from 4.30 until 6. I can vouch for the blushing geisha, a lovely girl from Kyoto I met while on the Mossman Gorge walk, but that's another story. Amazingly, Blushing Geisha is also the name of one of the cocktails available at Miss Chief, and she, I mean it, was delicious. At some point you'll want to cool off, you can then jump into the Cairns Lagoon, which is strangely cold given the number of kids that use it. And no holiday would be complete without a souvenir. Head to the daily night markets for a mix of genuine made in China, plus some made in Australia stuff too. Well that's about three minutes and I think that covers off on the must do's while in cans. Thanks for watching and how about hitting the like button and subscribing, it would make me smile. And you'll find out where I venture to next, until then stay safe and wear a helmet!